Ajoa, a spirited young woman, dreams of a life beyond her small village. Her family is respected, but modest. Inspired by tales of adventure and prosperity, she yearns to experience more and hopes for love that will help her see the world. A handsome trader named Kofi arrives in the village. With his wealth and charm, he captivates the villagers. Ajoa feels an instant connection as he speaks of distant lands, wealth, and the wonders he's seen. Kofi showers Ajoa with attention, taking her on strolls, telling her tales of riches, and hinting at a life of luxury. Her heart is swayed, believing that this could be her chance to escape village life. Ajoa's family is wary of Kofi's sudden interest. Her father warns her about trusting appearances, but Ajoa, eager for a new life, dismisses their concerns. She believes her love for Kofi is genuine. Kofi proposes, promising Ajoa a future of wealth and adventure. She eagerly accepts, confident that this union will fulfill her dreams. The village buzzes with excitement for the wedding of the year. The wedding is lavish, with Kofi sparing no expense. Ajoa feels like a queen, convinced that this opulence is only a glimpse of her future. Her family tries to be happy for her, despite lingering concerns. Married life starts well, and Ajoa is thrilled to explore her new home and lifestyle. She learns about Kofi's business ventures, though he remains secretive about certain aspects. She brushes it off, believing in him. Ajoa starts noticing inconsistencies in Kofi's stories. People approach her with strange hints, and Kofi grows distant. Doubts begin to cloud her mind as she realizes something is amiss in her new life. Ajoa discovers documents proving that Kofi's wealth is built on lies and deceit, involving manipulative deals that exploit others. Shocked and heartbroken, she feels the ground fall out from under her. Ajoa confronts Kofi, demanding the truth. He admits to his deceit but downplays his actions, insisting he did it for them. She is torn between her love for him and the betrayal she feels. Overwhelmed, Ajoa seeks solace by the river, reflecting on her past, her dreams, and how they've been shattered. She begins questioning her own decisions and wonders if she has the strength to start over. Ajoa returns to her family, who embrace her without judgment. Her parents' support and her village's kindness help her begin healing, making her realize that wealth isn't everything. With encouragement from her family, Ajoa starts crafting a plan to regain her independence. She decides to use her skills to contribute to the village, vowing to build a life of honesty. Kofi realizes that Ajoa's resolve is stronger than he anticipated. He tries to win her back, attempting to charm her as he once did, but she sees through his manipulation now. With the help of the village, Ajoa starts a small business selling handmade items. The villagers admire her resilience, and her business begins to thrive, giving her a new sense of purpose. As Ajoa finds success and happiness, a kind, honest man in the village begins to show interest. He respects her independence and admires her strength, but she's hesitant to trust again. Rumors spread that Kofi's dishonest dealings have caught up with him. His business collapses, and he faces disgrace. Ajoa watches from afar, feeling sadness but also relief. In a moment of introspection, Ajoa decides to forgive Kofi, not for him, but for her own peace. She feels free from his deceit, understanding that forgiveness doesn't mean forgetting. Ajoa fully embraces her new life, filled with purpose and self-respect. Her business flourishes, and she learns to value herself over material promises. She has grown into a strong, self-reliant woman. After much soul-searching, Ajoa opens her heart again to the new suitor. This time, she builds a relationship based on mutual respect and honesty, finding happiness not in wealth but in love and authenticity.